Sharky, Newcastle United won, Burn nil. Talk me through this game, man. How lucky were we to come away with three points? Well, I think Burton were very lucky not, not to come away with more than a 1 0 one, one defeat, if I'm honest. Um, the referee kind of helped them. Um, I think the referee had a really poor game from start to finish. We all knew uh, going into this game, Brighton, you know, the, uh, sorry, Burton, the, the, you know, they the got a good win against Huddersfield away. You know, they were always going to come and get 4 5 behind the ball. Um, you know, they were obviously, they're scrapping for points. And at this stage of the season, it's not about scoring five, six, seven goals. It's about the performances. It's about getting the three points, and that's what we needed today against against Burton. And obviously, we knew that they were, you know, they were going to try and shove out. What was your version of the penalty? Was it a penalty? Was it not a penalty? Talk me through that one. Well, it was, I'll be honest, it wasn't a penalty. I think I think Richie fell over, um, and obviously you were. The, the referee, obviously Gale, Gale fell down the first time, and obviously I think the referee's bought it, and obviously gave away a pen. So anything, you know, we've got, we've got the pen, 1-0, um, everyone was celebrating, I was, I was in rapture, I was like, yes, I was like, come on, 1-0. And then all of a sudden there was a, I don't know what happened, I don't know if, if, if there was a Newcastle player in the box when we scored it, or if there was a Burton player doing something, but then obviously there was a big altercation between Rafa Benitez, uh, the, the four officials, the referee, and the, you know, all the fans were confused, and I was one of them as well. And, and eventually they didn't give the, give the pen and I don't understand why if that's the case if, if, if he's given a pen and we've scored it why didn't you give the retake because if he's given the pen you've got to give a retake so after the penalty didn't go in and it's still nil-nil and we're all over them did you give up faith or did you think you know what we're gonna because I was thinking maybe it might be a draw I said it was gonna be a draw personally did you think it was still gonna be a draw or did you think it was gonna persist and get the goal no no uh, it was all about being patient. Like I say, it's not about how many goals you get. You know, these teams at the bottom, they're all battling for points. You know, a club like Burton, no disrespect, you know, it would be a, a record if they actually managed to stay in the championship, given their budget, probably the lowest in the championship. Um, you know, the, it was the same against Wigan. You know, the last game we had to be patient, and eventually we did. You know, yeah, Wigan did get their realised we've got the we've got the second goal to win it. But these games were always going to be tight. I did say three 0 in the prediction, and obviously it wasn't three 0 It could have been if it wasn't for the referee's performance. Um, but like I say. Um, we had so much you know, possession, we had so many chances. Um, I felt that we needed a target man, someone like Murphy to come on a bit earlier, maybe Mitrovic, because we were putting balls into the box, but it, we were kind of lacking in the final third. And I, felt, I always felt that, that Burton were comfortable at the back and they were, you know, they were kicking balls away. And the keeper seems, for Burton, it seemed like he was, you know, he was on, on track to maybe get his first clean sheet, but as like I say... How good was Richie though? I mean, he's come to the rescue again, second time in the game, the second time in two games, so I should say. Um, this guy is immense. I mean, he's, he's not even in the team of the season as well. I'm, I'm shocked with this. He should have, because to be fair, Richie has magic. He's got his magic hat, you know. He yes! 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 Ah, yeah, but like I say, Richie, you know, that bit of magic, you know, that, that run. And then obviously the way he just bent that past the, past the keeper in the top corner, what a goal that was. Um, that deserved to win any game, to be honest with you. And you know, like I say, you don't you don't drop from the Premier League for nothing. You don't pay, what, was it 12 million we paid for Richie? I said, that, that, that looks an absolute bargain now. Absolute I mean, bargain. Some, of the, some of the clubs now will be watching him. I hope, he, I hope he stays. But like I say, he's magic. He got the goal. He bent it in the top corner. And then obviously I always felt that we were going to go on and score more. But like I said, I'm happy with the 1-0. It's, you know, it's three points, 84 points now. Hopefully a couple of wins and we should be there. Well, we definitely needed that win. Obviously, uh, Brighton won. Um, Huddersfield lost to Burton. So again, the gap's extended. Um, obviously, got big games coming up against Leeds and Sheffield Wednesday. You know, how do you think we'll fare against those two teams as well? Sheffield have been a bit rocky. Like, they've won a few games, they've lost a few games, they've drawn a few games, but they won last night as well. So obviously, you know, against Rotherham, um, they're back in the playoffs. Uh, we've got to Hillsborough, you know, a, you know, a big club, Sheffield, um, you know, in the playoffs. Uh, it's going to be a tough game for us. Um, if we play a bit better than we did against uh, against Burton today, I think we might get the three points. But in my mind, I think I'd be happy with a draw at Hillsborough, and then obviously. Onto the Leeds game. I'm not going to that game, unfortunately, because it's, it's a sellout. Um, but I hope that we'll get the three points again at home. They're going to be vital for a promotion push.